goes into the pot and stir, 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 stir as hard and fast as you can. Ho, 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 ho. <laughs> Sorry, I can't do this and show you guys at the same time. I should have asked somebody to come over today. I forgot in my excitement. Alright, so now I hit it with a stick blender. Try to blend it super well and to keep the egg from curdling. <laughs> like an awful lot of blending, but I wanted to make absolutely sure that this isn't going to do anything funny. Did we win? I think we won, guys! I don't see any little yellow bits in here. point I'm gonna add the aloe vera to it and I'm also gonna add it's at a really thick trace now um, my fragrance oil it's the lavender again so it's super duper creamy there's no yellow flecks hanging around in there and uh, I'm excited because I think this worked sorry I know that was probably really loud on your speakers all right, I am going to put this into my mold that's hanging out over here. I'll let you guys see that too. Sorry, I'll turn it towards you so you can see. So you can see. Turn it towards me so I can see. And again, this is the same recipe that I've been using all week and some change just with extra stuff in it. And today is probably the weirdest one that you'll see. <laughs> Eggy. All the air bubbles out of it. There it is! Our egg soap. Well, that's a good way to look at this. Our egg soap is done! Alright, I am going to rush and put this under a blanket so that it doesn't cool down too much. It's already cooled down a bit. There it is! The question of the day is did it actually turn into soap? I turned it over and just kind of let it slowly fall out of there. So there it is. <laughs> it 
feels mushy. Are you tired of hearing me say that? It feels mushy. Um, okay, let's get on to the business of cutting this bad boy and seeing what it did on the inside. Because that'll tell us more than the outside, I think. It looks like it gelled on the inside. It turned to kind of, uh, yeah, got a little bit darker on the inside. So I know the inside gelled. That is very strange. See, a little bit darker on the inside than it is on the outside. I've gotten a couple of hints from some of you viewers on how to fix that though, or how to make sure that it doesn't gel or go through a gel phase anyway that would turn it colors but still cure. All very good suggestions. I like suggestions. Keep them coming. If I can do this better, I will. Yeah, this has quite a bit of drying out to do, despite the, uh, despite the beeswax. Still has a bunch of drying to do. Wow. <laughs> Eggs. I was wondering to myself last night as I was putting it in the, in the blankets, thinking to myself, man, I hope that this actually turns into soap. Or did I just make custard with lye in it? <laughs> lye -y custard. It is really super creamy though. If this does work out, I'm totally calling it my custard soap. Custard facial soap. Well, maybe not exactly that. That needs some work. Something to do with custard, though, because custard is delicious. Way delicioso. So there it is. That soap made with egg. My eggy soap. <laughs> and I'll definitely let you guys know um, how this works out. This will be ready to use in uh, late January. Uh, maybe early February, depending upon how how hard it gets, how quickly. I'm definitely going to give it four weeks, but if it's still soft, I'll give it another two weeks just to kind of hang out and become more hard so I don't lose all of it down the drain. But yes. I'm very excited about this. Now I can't wait for that month to be over. I want to use the soaps now. Eee. There's also less air bubbles in this one, which is really nice than I usually get. And there aren't any, um, I mean, there's some air bubbles here and there. There also aren't any curdled egg pieces in there, which is also really heartening. Um, that makes me happy. That means I think I did it right. Of course, I won't know for a month. So, I will keep you posted. And that is the end of day 10 of the 12 days of soap. Day 11 is coming up tomorrow. I'll see you guys then. Have a happy holidays.